Well, hello guys, welcome again to another edition of your everyday computer software tips and tricks. Today, I'll be showing you how you can do auto sums in Microsoft Word. So without wasting time, why don't we begin? So I'm in Microsoft Word right now and in here, I have a table which has a list of um, courses and the number of registrations at the various centers. So I want to find the sum for each of the centers in here in Microsoft Word. I don't want to move to Excel to be able to, to add all these numbers up. I want to be able to do everything in here in Microsoft Word. So to be able to do that, this is what you have to do. Down on the top right, on the top, very top section here from File Home, Insert, Draw, you see a number of menus in there. Now we need to go to Layout in here. By the way, I'm using Microsoft or Microsoft Word 2021. So it might, the, the menu might be in a different section for you. So from here, when I go to Layout and then I go to data in here you see um, a menu in here that says formula formula so this is what will give you the formula for you to be able to sum up all the table numbers or all the numbers or any number that you have in your table so all you need to do is click where you want the total to appear click that cell and then go to formula when you click on it pop-up will show up now it says equals sum of the above so what that means is it's going to calculate the sum of all the figures that are above the particular cell that you've selected so if that is what you want to do you want to sum up all the items above you just click on ok and then you you have the total in here very simple now let's do for the other sections as well so you come to formula above sum up equals sum above okay now you do the same for all the other cells and we'll just calculate the sum in there for you very simple another thing that you can, you can also explore is not only the sum but let's temporarily remove all the total from here now in when you hover your mouse on the formula sign in here you see it says formula add a formula to a cell to perform a simple calculation such as average sum or count so let's just say you want to um, perform a simple calculation such as an average on all the numbers above so again we click on the cell we go to formula now instead of sum we change that and we type in the average so we want to find the average of all the numbers above that cell. So once you click on OK, you see it also calculates the average in there for you. Let's just try for, for the second column. So in there to remove the average, remove the sum and then we put in the average. So you see it just calculates the average for you. Now, if you don't want to calculate the average, but you want to find the count, or, or the number of items you have in here, the number of figures. You can also do count. So instead of the sum, you can type in the count. And then it will count the number of items that you have above in there. So this is a simple way you can do simple calculations in Microsoft Word. It's not all the time that you have to move to Microsoft Excel to do all these calculations. And when the calculations get more complex, you will then have to move to Microsoft Excel to, to be able to perform all those changes. So this is a simple way to do auto sums in Microsoft Word. If you found this video useful, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss any new videos I'll be uploading very soon. Thank you very much for joining me and I hope to see you in the next video.